I just spilled tropical punch all over myself and the chair. That's nice. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a pink lemonade look. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video because I had a lot of fun making it. I couldn't decide what look to originally go with, so there was a lot of trial and error, but I eventually figured it out and sat down and filmed this video. So stay tuned to see how I got this look. So if you couldn't tell from the title of this video or my intro, this is going to be a pink lemonade look, which was really highly suggested. Sorry about my contour today, it's not really working. So what you're going to need for this is a mustard yellow. I'm using the shade Martian Soil from the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Alien Palette. You're also going to need some pinks and another yellow, and so I'm using the shades Quench and Taste Buds from the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Thirsty Palette for this. And then you're also going to need a pink shimmer. And I'm using the ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in Set to Stun, which is honestly one of my favorite products. You don't have to use the same exact products as me. In no way am I saying this. This is just what I have and what works for me. So just whatever you have laying around, use that. So let's get started on this. <sighs> that little boy is not stop screaming, I'm gonna go crazy. Okay, so starting off with my favorite Wet n Wild brush, I'm going to dip into the shade Gravity from the Alien palette. I'm gonna tap the excess off like that. I'm just gonna go into my crease, just kind of swirl it in like that because you're going to want some kind of warm color in there. It can be a light peachy, it can be a taupey warm shade. You just want something light in there. So like that. And then next I'm taking the shade Martian Soil, which comes off really pretty. And so I'm going to blend that under there. And just keep blending it in. If it overtakes the lighter shade completely, that's fine. And so you're going to do that in the other eye as well. And you're just gonna keep blending until you're satisfied with how it looks. Alright, so like that, and I'm just going to tap a little bit more of Gravity in there, like so, and then next I'm going to take the shade Quench from the Thirsty Palette, I'm just going to tap my brush into that, kind of have to dig it in there. I find that with the Thirsty palette, the mattes are a little patchy, to say the least, and so I'm just going to pat that all over my eye right here, and then I'm going to repeat that with the other eye, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I have Quench packed in all over my lids, and I think I'm going to take Martian Soil again, and just blend over the top of that just to give it a little more depth now you don't have to take it all the way up the brow bone like I did I'm just experimenting with this look I've only done this look once before and so next I'm going to take a concealer brush if I can find it there it is and I'm going to cut this part of the lid right here using, of course, my Maybelline concealer because I have yet to get another one. I really should try some new foundations and stuff on this channel. So I'm just going to cut the lid a little right there. So 
so that we can add our pinks. Like that, and I'm going to repeat the process with the other eye, and then we can come back. Okay, so taking the Thirsty palette again, I'm going to use the shade Parched, which is that really tan shade right there. And I'm just going to pat that where I set the concealer, just to set it a bit. And then next, I'm going to take the shades... Uh, I'm going to take the shade Taste Buds, and I'm just going to pat that all in there. Because then that way we can get a pink base. You could get the pink to your liking and stop right there, just leave it matte and then add a liner. But for those of you who are dramatic and like glitter, we're going to add glitter. Don't worry. <sighs> okay, not gonna lie, this body armor and tropical punch stuff, really good. And it's supposed to be like better than powdered. Okay, so continuing, I'm going to take the color grudge shade set to stun. And so I'm going to dip my brush in there, get it all coated like that, and spritz it with my setting spray. I'm literally almost out of it. Like, I need to get more of this, but I plan on getting that new mini MAC setting spray or the SPF one, which will come really, it'll come in handy because Color Guard is nuts. You know the little hobo walking through? That's my little brother. Shut up. <laughs> so we're adding that in there, and as you can see, it looks really nice How with the yellow. How many do you have? What does it matter to you? I don't know. <laughs> 37. 37? Yeah. You're famous. Oh yeah. Okay, so we've got that done. And now we're going to move on to the other eye and repeat our exact same process. Okay. So, right under the eyes, I'm going to take this corally shade. I'm not going to say the name because it's bad. I'm going to mix it with the shade Stroke, and we're going to put that on the lower lash line. So, taking that. Where's that? Okay. Now you could take a tan shade and pop it in your waterline, or a pink, or a yellow, or even a black if you're feeling adventurous, which I'm not going to do that today. And so there's that. We've got that little pop of shadow right there. And for the inner corner, I'm going to take the shade uh, Pluto from the Alien palette. Just that white right there. Spritz it with my Mario Badescu. This is the Orange Spring Aloe one, which I really like. I've tried the Green Tea and Cucumber, the Chamomile one, and the Orange one. The Green Tea and the Orange ones are definitely my favorite so far. And so I'm going to put on some mascara. No falsies today because I'm not feeling it. Do my brows and finish this up. Okay, so this look is almost done. I've got my highlight, my blush. Ignore right here, I went a little crazy. And so now I'm going to take the Jeffree Star of the Lord Lip Good Lipstick in Thirst Trap. This was from last year's summer collection along with the Thirsty palette. And I'm going to apply this. And 
good move up on some setting spray and we're done. Okay, so that's it. I hope you guys liked this video, so please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below what you want to see me do next. Brow tutorial, no makeup makeup, my normal makeup routine. I just want some suggestions. Oh, and one more thing. Shout out to my homegirl Brie. Add on Snap, Pickle Pickle 15. Or hit her up on Instagram, Brianna underscore Patterson 15. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.